about one o'clock just Tuesday afternoon, I was uh, working on a water heater in the backyard and uh, looked behind me and there was a drone. It was like a remote control airplane with about a three foot wingspan. It was about three foot long. And the, there were lights flashing on it. The, a big camera in the front, like a military drone has, the rotating ball with a laser beam and a camera on it. Big sign that said, don't look into the laser. So, and the tail section was moving like someone was trying to control it. About 15 minutes later, the tail section came down out of a tree behind me and it uh, landed in the driveway, so I'm pretty sure it hit the tree first. The wing had busted away from the, the uh, rest of the drone and was laying on the ground next to it and the camera was laying, assembly was laying next to it. But uh, it didn't appear to be designed to come apart like that. It didn't appear to be too broken. I just it looked very expensive and I couldn't figure out who owned it, so I wrote my telephone number on a uh, piece of paper because the camera was moving and held it in front of the camera, thinking someone would call me if they wanted it back. And uh, that didn't work out, so I called the police and they came and picked it up. Uh, later that afternoon, I wasn't home and my wife was home and the Fort Carson representatives and the police came by and checked out the area and thanked thanked us for returning their drone to them, and uh, that, we appreciate that very much.